Hey you guys, welcome back. Today's video, I am going to be filming my review on the ColourPop Velvet Luxe Liquid Lipsticks. I bought the entire collection so I could review and swatch all of it on my lips for you guys today. I actually just got done filming the 14 lip swatches so I'm not currently wearing it on my lips because 14 lip swatches, I just need to nourish my lips. So I'm not currently wearing it. I'm just wearing a lip balm on top, but you guys will see all the colors on my lips against my skin tone. I'll talk about this new formulation. So if you guys are interested in all of that, then just continue watching. To get started with the review, let's start off with some product info. This is a new formulation from ColourPop. They do have the normal Luxe liquid lipsticks that came out with the Disney collection, the Midnight Masquerade. That's when it first came out. And now we have a new formulation in that family. So the claim for this formulation from ColourPop is that it's a pillowy, soft velvet liquid lipstick that creates a soft diffuse look. These are eight US dollars each if you do want to buy them individually, but you can get them in these little duos for 15 US dollars. And obviously there are seven sets in total making 14 shades. I bought this whole collection when ColourPop had their like 25% off sale. I just went on the website now and I couldn't find this actual set. So maybe it was just like a limited edition thing. I'm not too sure. So I'm just going to hold one up as reference as I'm chatting about the product. If you guys are familiar with my channel and my preferences, you would know that I typically stay away from liquid lipsticks in general. They're just not my thing. I like to stick to the just a tint lip crayons or glosses or lipsticks. I'm just not a huge fan of liquid lipsticks because my lips are quite dry. So I find that any liquid lipstick on my dry lips is just uncomfortable. It doesn't look good. But actually wearing this formulation on my lips actually feels really comfortable. You know when you wear like a liquid lipstick and it's like a matte finish? It like literally sucks out all the moisture on your lips. This doesn't do that. I would agree that it's quite pillowy. It's very bouncy, very light. It's almost moussey in a way, but it just feels really amazing on the lips. It applies super smoothly as well. With the applicator as well, I think it's very, very easy to apply. Usually with any lip product, I will apply it and use a lip brush to really get precise with it. But because of this applicator, I didn't need to use an extra brush because it's just so pointy and it's so easy to get around your lip corners. In terms of how long it lasts on your lips, I would say it will last you a couple of hours. For me personally, whenever I eat, all of my lip products will come off. I don't know how I'm eating or if I'm just constantly wiping my mouth when I do eat that my lip product is always gone no matter what it is. So when I wear this, it's only going to last me until I eat. But if I wasn't going to eat, I would say it probably lasts you a good maybe four hours just like a normal liquid lipstick would. I do want to note that I did wear one of these shades. I think it was Genie. I wore it for a long period of time and I filmed a couple of videos so I was talking a lot and I noticed that there was a lot of buildup in the inner rim of my lip. It was just for that shade specifically, but I've only worn a couple shades for a long period of time. I haven't worn all 14 shades for like an extensive amount of time to note every shade, but with Genie, I did see that. So you might see that with some of the other colors, but I'm just unsure since I haven't tried them out to that extent. I do quickly want to touch on the actual packaging and the component of the liquid lipstick. I think it looks really pretty, simple, classy. But the problem that I had is that when you are looking at the actual component and the actual shade inside and once you apply it onto your eyes, it looks very different. When you're looking at the bottle itself, it can be a little bit deceiving because it is in this little frosted bottle because when I saw this color for example this one is called casual dress this looks so cool toned to me that I was like nope I don't want to even try this because I know it's not gonna like look that good on me but once you apply it onto your lips it's like quite different I think the bottle makes it look a little bit more cool toned a little bit more gray in a way but you can only buy this online so it's not going to be a big problem because it's not like you're going in stores and looking at it so I don't know why I mentioned that, but I did, so there's that. Now, if we want to talk in comparison to the original Lux Liquid Lipstick, I would say they're actually quite similar, but obviously this one is more of that velvet finish. The other one, I would say, is a little bit more drying than the velvet one. The velvet one definitely feels a lot smoother and more bouncy. It really does pull more like the Ultra Blotter Lip. The Ultra Blotter Lip is definitely more drier than the Lux Liquid Lipstick in general, but it has that similar light flavor 
fluffy texture when you are applying it to your lips so if you want to compare it to that this one just feels a lot more comfortable it doesn't make my lips look dried out cracky it looks very flattering it feels very comfortable on the lips so to like really conclude this little review this new velvet liquid lipstick formula is my favorite liquid formula from Colourpop I think it's the most comfortable and for someone that doesn't like liquid lipsticks this is definitely a formula that I can get on and actually wear sometimes with certain looks you just need a liquid lipstick to pair well with it I'm not saying it's like my new go-to formula in general like I will still stand by the just a tint lip crayons that is just the best formula but if we're talking about the liquids this one's definitely the most comfortable to wear on the lips i really enjoy the applicator on the luxe liquid lipsticks rather than the ultra line so definitely i'm a big fan of these i would highly recommend them to you guys So my favorite out of the bunch definitely would have to be room service. I think on my skin tone, this is like the perfect everyday lip color just up my alley. I love this shade so much. Another great everyday one is casual dress. I think a lot of you guys would like this one as well. It's a little bit lighter, more on that mauve side. Some other shades that I did enjoy was Air Kiss, Lucky Cat, and Big Bang. Definitely all of the shades are super pretty, but these are the ones that stood out to me as I was swatching them on my lips. 
and the shades that I would see myself like gravitating towards more but definitely room service is like an everyday all around good color just like how you know in the luxe lipsticks layover is my go-to girl just a tint is rise and shine I think in the velvet luxe liquid lipstick family room service would have to be my go-to color so yeah hopefully that little review was sort of helpful everything made sense but we can now move into the comparisons And this, you guys, is going to conclude today's review. I hope you guys found it helpful. I really do enjoy filming these lip swatches for you guys because I think for these kinds of videos is where I get the most comments about like, thank you for swatching them on me. I just needed to find someone that had a similar skin tone to me. So that really makes me happy and I'm glad I can be of service. <laughs> but yeah, let me know which shade was your favorite. Which shade are you thinking about picking up? If you have already picked some up, which shades are your favorite I would love to hear your thoughts on this new formulation it's always exciting to see new formulation from Colourpop I'm always so excited about it so this one was a good one thumbs up from me I would highly recommend them but yes if you guys did enjoy this video be sure to give the video a thumbs up for me I would appreciate it so much my lips would appreciate it so much as well thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe if you haven't already I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video bye